a Zen trade game production. The Roman Empire was a master of controlling the masses. Through a combination of political, social, and economic strategies. One of the most effective methods was the concept of bread and circuses by providing free grain and sensational entertainment like the gladiator games and chariot races. The Roman authorities kept the populace distracted and comfortable, preventing unrest and rebellion. Also, the Romans used propaganda, monumental architecture, and public works to project power and stability, reinforcing the emperor's image as a benevolent and omnipotent ruler. In today's world, similar strategies can be observed. Modern governments and corporations often use media and entertainment to influence public opinion and maintain social order. For example, the constant stream of news, social media, and reality TV shows can serve as distractions from important societal issues. Also, large-scale events like sports championships and concerts can unify and pacify the masses, much like the Roman spectacles. In addition, contemporary political leaders and corporations use propaganda and public relations campaigns to shape their image and control narratives. Just as Roman emperors built grand structures to showcase their power, modern leaders and businesses invest in impressive infrastructure and marketing to project success and stability. While the methods have evolved, the underlying principles of mass control remain strikingly similar, highlighting the enduring nature of these strategies across centuries. If you like this video, then you'll really love this next one.